Hey y'all, it's your niche coach, Alicia Lester. And today I wanted to talk about um, speaking life into your husband. I know all the time we always want somebody to speak life into us and, and fill us up with all these amazing things and all these affirmations and all kinds of stuff, honey. We get things sent to our phones and all of that. But how awesome would it be for you to be able to speak those same things into your husband in a way in which he understands it now? Of course, he don't want to hear beautiful, sexy, all that. I get that. But in a way that he can understand it. One thing about me and my husband, my husband comes to me all the time with about 50,000 different ideas. And so what I do is I speak life into all of those ideas because what if it was the other way around and I kept coming to him with all these different ideas and all these different things. I know how hard he would go for me because he has. So I make sure I do those same things in return. Some of that same goodness that I want him to say to me, honey, I shoot it right back out there at him because I need him to know that I'm here. I'm present. I'm your partner. We're not in a competition, honey. We are in this together because if one of these things kick off, I'm your teammate all the time. So you need to make sure that you are speaking these positive things into him. I'm not talking to the ones that ain't nobody speaking anything into you. Honey, you are in the wrong relationship. That ain't even what we're talking about right now, okay? I'm talking to the people that have someone that is willing to go above and beyond for your dreams. You make sure that you are willing to go above and beyond for theirs. Sometimes they just need the confidence. Sometimes they just need a word of reassurance. Sometimes those are the things that men need. Oftentimes men have the money to execute the things that they want. Honey, they just need that confidence to make sure that they're taking the right steps because men, they don't take as many chances with their money as women do. Honey, we'll go and buy something unseen, haven't smelled it, haven't anything, honey. We just want it because the box is pretty. Men are a little bit different when it comes to their money. So make sure you are speaking life unto this person, whatever the investment is. Um, invest your time. Invest your attention. Again, you are not his competition, honey. If you are opening up a boutique and he is trying to open up something else, you don't have to worry about it because the business plan is the same. The blueprint is the same. It's to get paid, it's to get by, it's to get ahead, it's to get through. So you have to make sure you are getting it together. And you'd be so surprised at how speaking that into him and giving him that confidence, honey, it does wonders to a man's ego. It does wonders to a man's pride. It does wonders to his life. So make sure you are being that for him. Because if you're not being that for him, honey, then you are just in the way. And dead weight, you know what I'm saying? That's not what people need, okay? So you make sure that you are being that person. Go above and beyond for your mate. I'm saying husband, honey, because that I'm, I'm married. But you might be in a strong-ass relationship that has potential to go to the moon. You better be there and speak positivity into that thing. If not, honey, you just wasting time. I'm your niche coach.